Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of World Conquer 4 and today we are playing as Republic of China 1950 Yes, so the last time we clear almost out of China the communists they are on the run and we are doing good very very good and right now let's just play all together without further ado and last time I did not enter as far as I remember so let's just enter all together well, we also got our own general which is uh, Larek Gonel uh, Darion he's almost dead you can see only, only, only one more left. But he's wife though. Yeah, that's cool. He's a legend. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna get Hanoi next turn. For this turn, let's just chill a bit and enter all together. We will wait and see. And yes. Not so much. Okay, gonna wait for the turn to end. Uh, I will vote. Oh, sorry, I will put a poll you guys can vote on which nation should I play next. Okay, so looks like he's still alive and healthy. So I'm going to upgrade the supply depot for him. And looks like he's American, I thought it was uh, Chinese. Okay, so I'm going to go to Lansha. Lasha, sorry, Lasha, not Lansha, Lasha. Okay. Nice, good. One is two. Uh, what about Lanchu? And maybe I need a level three so that I can get a good glimpse of region. Okay, so we don't have another general to go, so we're gonna go plain without general. Uh, good. Another one and heavy tanks. Nice. We're gonna try to go to Indo China. And we will take them out one by one. So that's the tactics. Uh, we will take them out. Okay. Good. Nice. Okay, so they have one city at the north. Maybe we can go there. Yeah, we can go there. Just try to steal it. Okay, good. End turn. It is end a lot of turns. Uh, maybe I will do 20 or 15. Depends on uh, the time recording. Okay, so okay, good. Sixty-two turns wasn't that bad, wasn't it? Okay, capture that one, good, and take out this to the forts, and we're gonna take the Hui. But uh, the Indochina they still have uh, this uh, occupation. So we need to be more precise and careful with them. Okay, that's good. Maybe bombers. Okay, good pair of troops. Nice and okay. Sorry, I'm sorry, that one. Okay. Uh, let's see. Gonna take Hanoi. Okay. Good. Good. Even though it is not that good, but we'll take it. Okay. And Darion. How about this? How about okay? So maybe, maybe we can change. Okay. Good. 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 Okay. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Okay. Uh, and Lancha. Okay. Still not that good. One more. Nice. Okay. Take out this artillery rocket. And gonna build more medium tanks. Okay, medium tanks. Okay, heavy tanks. Sorry, got that one egg. So end turn. We're gonna try to march uh, until we reach Moscow. And we're gonna end this episode until we reach Moscow. And maybe we're gonna try to go to Arab. To. Uh, sorry, not Arab. Uh, Mesopotamia, Middle East. Yeah, the Middle East. Okay. Uh, I'm not trying to clear this guy first because they are really messy. Yeah, coots. Okay, good. Parachute. Okay, very nice. And what about this? Oh, they they, they made another general. Well, never mind. And we're going to go to Phnom Penh. You know the the Phnom Penh, uh, it's which is my city. Uh, Phnom stands for mountain. Uh, it's not Phnom Penh. 
the American they pronounce it as Phnom Penh, but it's actually if 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 it's pronounced as my own accent in my country, uh, Phnom Penh, Phnom Penh, not not Phnom Penh, it's Phnom Penh. Phnom is a mountain, and Penh is the person who found the city. Penh is a name of of a old lady. She's the richest. She's like Bill Gates back then. Yeah, she's the richest of the rich. And then she has her ha. Uh, she had her house, which is at the bank of the river. And uh, one day, during the flood, her house uh, was the highest on the ground. So which means that uh, she can survive without flooding her house. And then after the flood has ended, in the next morning, she was walking uh, to the bank of the river, try to get some fresh air. And then suddenly she found a rock. Not a rock. Sorry. Uh, uh, a tree, a trunk of trees, uh, a longest one, full of four Buddhas, full of four Buddhas, and those uh, four Buddhas uh, were from uh, Laos. You guys should know Laos. Laos, Laos is uh, in a landlock in ASEAN. Yeah, from Laos, and the old lady she saw this as a good fortune, so she gathers the whole village, and she start to build a temple and a sanctuary for the. Uh, the four statue that she found in the long, uh, uh, long uh, tree trunks, and people start to come over and live. Okay, so we capitulated. People like China. That's good. Okay, so continue our story. So uh, people start to come to live, and then they start to call this area Peng, which is by her name Peng. And then when the mountain where the sanctuary was built, it became larger and larger, it becomes a mountain. First it was like a hill, a small hill. But since people start to come and live at that area, they start to call it Phnom Phnom, like Phnom Penh, Phnom Penh. So it became the capital uh, of the cities. And when the king uh, changed his uh, a, a, a palace, he also gave a name of the Phnom Penh. Which is very long. It's like Thailand. Thailand they also had their own, uh, their own uh, city names, which is not just Bangkok. It's Krong Tep, Mohanoko, something like that. It's the same as uh, my languages, but Thailand they had more complicated writing system. I don't know why. Uh, we both uh, had some bad thing in the past altogether between Cambodia and Thailand, but we still we re resolved already all of things. Okay, just noob Ulat Sai and maybe we can take Ulat Sai. Uh, okay, good. Yeah. Build more nooks, build more nooks, build more nooks. Okay, good. Still need to take Hanoi and Phnom Penh. Yeah, Phnom Penh again. Yeah, so that's the story of the name Phnom Penh. Yeah. Uh, first, when I start learning English, I feel cringe whenever people try to pronounce something which is not uh, from their own native, and they try to make that sound so ridiculous. Like sometimes I I just wonder myself why do I why do I have to pronounce the same as them so that they can know what it is? Yeah, actually it's it's if it's stress. Our language has a stress which uh, made it clear for a speaker. To understand what we are trying to say yeah so that's the advantages of my language and hopefully next time if easy tech they release a game hopefully they add Cambodia yeah as my only one and only hope that they add Cambodia uh, I don't ask for much easy tech uh, I hope you hear me okay and I hope you guys are watching my video too because I, I always promoted your games yeah try to endorse Okay, so we're gonna take Hanoi. Okay, good. So only Phnom Penh left. Phnom Penh, not Phnom Penh. Okay, Phnom Penh. Okay, good. Phnom Penh is down. And we're gonna move to Saigon or Ho Chi Minh City or Prainoko. Yeah, we also have backstory at the Mekong Delta. <coughs> there are 21 uh, provinces which are uh, native, uh, Khmer native, Cambodian native, they live there. Uh, they were called Khmer Krom, which means that the uh, the downside of Cambodian, yeah, all those stuff. It, it has some different names. Okay, so you guys might, yeah, you guys might wonder why it has some different name. Yeah, it has some backstory back in the past. Okay, so gonna take Astana, and this one too. I don't know what it is. It has no names. Okay. 
Okay, good. So I'm gonna take Astana and this one. Okay, that's good. Also another one from here. We, only, we also need to take Tehran. And looks like the French, they did a good job. Okay, American, they landed in Amsterdam. We need to take no bricks in this one. So I guess we can no longer do that. Uh, okay, maybe we can take this one. Okay. And you guys, uh, maybe you guys can vote. I will put a poll from, from this video. You guys can vote. Uh, I will choose the nation. For 1950 because we have done so many 1950 nations and I almost forgot half of it already so maybe I can check my list on which nation should I play okay another one two from here okay okay very nice and airports good and we're gonna take this and this who the fucking sink? Damn. Uh, my neighbors, they are really terrible and annoying. All the time. All the time. All the time. They always sing, they always make noise. They never care about uh, their neighbors, which is basically me. Yeah. They, can, they don't give a damn. And after this year, maybe uh, in December, I will have my own studio. So there will be webcam, there will be uh, a studio of my own. I will build one. I already have the equipment. I just need to patch it up because I will move. I will be moving into a new house in December. So yeah, congratulations to myself. Yeah, that's a good one. Uh, yeah, we'll have a studio. That will be good. You know, uh, less annoying and also a bit more quiet. Yeah. So maybe I will. I will leave this to. I will leave this to Canadian. To Canadian, they will do their job. We're gonna go to Novorov Seabirx. Okay. Uh, how far is it? Okay. We can still take Novorov Seabirx. Novorov Seabirx. Okay. Pair troops. Very nice. And what about this? Okay. Oh, Larex still alive. Thank God. Okay. Let's see. Uh, take this out. Good, good. One more. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna take that one. Okay. So another one. Saratov or Stalingrad? Maybe uh, Zaratov, I'm gonna take Zaratov because it also has a missile, so it's gonna be good. And I believe that the Soviet they also have a good uh, technology, that's why they can build uh, in each of different cities. Okay, Zaratov, I'm gonna take that one, nice, good. And yet to get in back. And also this one over here too. Okay, so it looks like they are all moving their units to the north. Okay. Good. Okay, so maybe we can take uh, Moscow. Mm, okay. Good parachute, regular river. Okay, so that's good. We captured half of the continent already, only Mongolia left. Okay, so we're gonna need to take Africa too because Africa is overrun by the communists. And turn. Okay. So look like Japan got saved by Americans. Well, that's a good job by the Americans. They always come late. I don't know why. They're just too lazy. Okay, so we got the first one. We also got the first technology. So where was our city? Yeah, upgrades, upgrades, so we got our first technology. Okay, good. Okay, very nice. Uh, and yes, we are going to take Moscow. Now or never. Okay, 
Okay, nuke. And another one, nuke. Okay. Okay, one more I guess we can done. Okay, still not yet. But we can search the bombings. Okay, good. So Moscow has fallen. Well, that's nice for this one. So, uh, yeah, like I said, this is gonna end the first, so not the first, uh, this the third episode of uh, our sea people, uh, sorry, Republic of China. I hope you guys enjoy this one and have a nice day, guys, and see you guys later in the next episode.